So I keep working it with my thumb. Just keep working it right down. If you don't use a piece, if you don't use the contact cement, take a piece of masking tape and we'll go one wrap around when you first get this end on. Otherwise, it'll start unraveling on you. So now we're getting close to the end and you're going to continue this. Cork all the way around. right to the end. You take your scissors and you're going to follow the blank right back. Keep the scissors pushed against the blank and just trim. And that'll take you right back. Any little bit of excess, just trim it off. You have a nice, neat fit. Now what I do is I take a piece of shrink wrap. Again, the contact cement is optional. And I'll put a little bit of contact cement on there. If you want a little bit of excitement, you don't let that contact cement dry. Put your shrink wrap on, like so. And what I usually do is I'll leave about a uh, quarter to a half inch sticking out the back. And the reason I do that is when I shrink this, You'll see that shrink wrap come right down behind there. And what I'll do is I'll take this little nub and push it right inside the blank. And that gives me some extra protection. We all know what it's like being out on the rocks. You want as much protection as you can get on the bottom here. So by doing that, it gives it that much more. And I'll take my buck cap, very simple. You can use anything, you can use five minute epoxy. I use a little bit of contact cement. And again, put it inside the cap, because if you put it on here, it's just gonna bunch up and make a mess on you. So a little bit of contact cement. And we just slide that. Pop it right on. You got a nice neat finish. Now for the top end, what you want to do is you can do one of two things. You can either take your shrink wrap and put it up here as a quick method. You're going to slide that up here. Or what I do is I wrap this in thread. If you're going to use shrink tube, on the top end here, make sure you do that first. Slide your shrink tube on and heat it up and get it glued on here. I didn't put shrink tube on here because I'm going to wrap this in thread and epoxy it. Give it a nice neat finish. <laughs> 